So I recognize that I am not a good vlogger. I am so sorry, but it's been so much movement. I only have about 15 minutes until I have to go catch my van. So I thought I'd just sit here and like update you guys on what's going on. This is my first official trip um, that I got assigned today. Yesterday I was on standby and I was just like sitting in the airport for about four hours. I wasn't called at all. Um, so I just literally sat there and then I got released. Oh my goodness. Let me tell you guys, I was like with like a couple of my friends from training. Um, because we all had like the same assignment yesterday. Um, and we were leaving and we were leaving out of the airport waiting for our shuttle to come back to the hotel. And there was like this um, young Italian woman and she was so distraught. And she like came up to me like with all of her bags, like crying and asked um, if I could help her. She Her English was good, but like she like needed a little bit of help because she like couldn't understand like the airport and like she had like these specific instructions that she needed to whatever to get her ride back to her hotel we stopped and i helped her um and i felt good about that because i was like oh like not my first day and somebody's just like they saw me in my uniform and like recognized that like i work here and i'm just glad that i was able to like to help her because she was oh, like she was down bad but yeah, so anyways, that was yesterday. Um, so that was my technically first day working, but this is my first trip. It stays my first trip. I'm really excited. Guess where we're going? Guess where our first trip is? It's to Panama. I've always wanted to go to Panama. Um, me and my friend joke around, joke around, we're so serious, but we joke around about moving to Panama and like, just like retiring there or whatever so i'm so happy and i'm super grateful that that's literally my very first trip as a flight attendant so um definitely bringing my bathing suit because i'm pretty sure it's super hot down there it's a five hour flight um and then i have a 12 i only have a 12 hour layover but that's okay i wish i had a longer layover but that's okay i'll be back um in my base tomorrow afternoon so Wish me luck, my very first trip. Okay, here's the fit. I'm wearing my pants today. Um, because I really wanna wear my dress, but it's not tailored yet, and I look like a granny in it because it's oversized. But I look like a granny. I gotta figure out a better way to tie my scarf because I just do like a little bow. Um, I think I'll just watch some YouTube videos at a time that conveniences me. But whenever I put this uniform on, I just feel like, oof, I'm that girl. I can't believe I'm a flight attendant, like for real. It's crazy. Training was wild, I can't believe it's done. And that now I'm about to go on my first trip. I can't believe that I'm here. Um, Cause it's so random. Like I just, you know, I got laid off from my job and then I randomly applied to be a flight attendant like within that same week. And so that was like the end of March and now it's the beginning of August. So like four months later, I'm a flight attendant. Like that's really crazy. I didn't think that this was where my life was gonna take me, but we're here. <laughs> we're here, we're here with it. And we're grateful, we're real grateful. Um, I'm excited and I'll just like see you guys. I'll come back when I'm in Panama. I'll show you guys my hotel. I don't want to show you guys this hotel room because it's already been lived in. It's been lived in for a bit, so it's like, I don't want to show you. But yeah, I'll come back when I'm in, I've landed in Panama, and we'll chat then. We'll chat then. Why is this hotel so nice? Why is this hotel room so nice? I'm going to show you. Hold on. This is the front way, front entrance. Okay. Ooh, yeah. The bathroom, the shower is gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous shower. A gorgeous shower. <laughs> <laughs> and the toilet, whatever. Art. A little vanity section. Look at the sink. Oh, 
this door opens into the room. Which was, if you walk that way, it was right there. But. Oh my gosh, this room is so pretty. Wow. This room is so cute. Obviously, I've landed. Um, the flight was, it was, it was a, it was a hectic. It was, it was my first flight, so I think that's why, you know. But um, it was, like, <clears throat> it was like uh, almost a five-hour flight. Um, I was doing economy service, and um, yeah, that's really it. it. There wasn't really any issues or anything. I honestly like um, the crew that I got set up with today was super helpful the um person in the galley in the back with me she was like super helpful and like we were kikiing back there so she's cool um i'm actually gonna get changed and then head to the cafe that's downstairs because it's literally 8 42 p.m and i'm hungry and i'm tired Honestly, I know like I only worked like technically like five hours, about five hours, but it just it feels so long. It felt so long. <laughs> um, and my feet hurt, and I'm hungry, so I need to get out of this freaking blazer and fit and uh, go get some food. Wait, um, um, tomorrow's flight. I'm not with the same crew tomorrow. Um, but I leave my vans at like 7.45 in the morning, so I'm gonna wake up at like 6.45 in the morning and get ready. Then my flight's at 8.45 I'm going back to my base. So, yeah, I think today, I think this trip was really cool. The sunset was so pretty. Looking at the sunset and the sky is crazy. They don't tell you that. I don't tell you i mean like of course sunset's beautiful but like it's it's magnificent <laughs> it's magnificent and the sky if you're watching this you should be a flight attendant just so that you can see the pretty the prettiness of the sky at sunset and yeah okay now good morning um i just wanted to quickly show you guys my view because I'm about to leave soon to head back to the states so let me just show you guys my view okay there's like a whole bunch of buildings and like hotels look at that building y'all it is so pretty like I can't even anyways over to the right we have all this water can't really show you guys the rest, but yeah. And all the people, the streets. As as my first time coming to Panama, I it's it's giving, it's reminding me more of like um like Miami or Vegas because like in this hotel there's literally a casino downstairs. And like with all these buildings and stuff, not that I was expecting, like I know like Panama is like a huge city like and it's growing and blah 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 and i didn't expect it to be like this like it is it looks like miami to me this is miami i hope you guys enjoyed this video i actually am i gonna sign off here yeah i think i'll sign off here because i mean all i'm gonna do is just go back to my base and then tell you guys that i got back to my base and that be that